Hi friends, I am Shravana and welcome back to my channel Sparkling Future. Before starting with today's topic, I request all of you to subscribe to my channel and also please like, share, comment and hit the bell icon for the latest video notifications. Thank you. Friends, today we will discuss like how to rename all the columns dynamically in a data frame in PySpark. In the interest of time, I have written the code. Now I will explain that in today's discussion. Friends, I have a file and I am reading that as CSV and option is uh, like a header is true of course, it has header. So if you see this data frame, you can notice like in all the headers, there is a space between the uh, uh, like uh, two words and it will be difficult if there is a space like this, right? We need to change it I mean replace space with something or you may need to change the column names in some requirement right so today we will see how to do that in PySpark first what I have done is I have created a data frame called customer space df which I mean to say that there is a space between the headers in the header name and out of that I am taking I am creating one calls variable with the list list of columns from this customer space dot df here you can see right i am taking the columns only columns means only headers of that and creating this list and i am creating another data frame and applying the reduce function this reduce function will apply the operation repetitive manner until the given condition is like how many number of values are present in the list those many times it will loop through and finally it will reduce the result and it will return as a data frame so how we can do that is inside and this reduce we can use in, in combination of lambda so that we can apply like map kind of operation here new df means the new data frame that we are going to create using the with column renamed option i is for index or iteration like each, each uh, element in this list and for this new df i am saying that with the column renamed friends now we are going to rename the columns right so for that we should use with column renamed option and for each column replace space with underscore and these are the columns to be used in this reduce operation and in this uh, data frame we have to perform this operation okay and i am saying that df underscore 2 so when i execute this you can see that in this header Sorry, this one okay in this header everything is changed like the space is replaced with underscore here in all the columns and if you notice only for the customer email there is a dot here so if there are more than one such things are there then you can add the replace like this as well or you can use replace all option using the rejects okay so replace dot with underscore some brace is missing give me a second yeah and if you notice even that customer email that dot got replaced with underscore so this is the way we can modify the same we can do using fold left in scala okay i have already done the video using scala so now this is using pyspark and we can use reduce and lambda function combination and let's say now only like uh, the the op, uh, delimiter uh, if you wanted to change you can use this way and let's say you have to replace the column names completely and you have to replace all the columns let's say so for that first 
you need to have the old columns which means the customer space dot columns which will hold the old columns and I am using that with the new columns okay in the new columns I mean uh, here only the underscore or uh, the space is the issue so now you can see now if let's say the uh, values that are coming from the data file that you are using might be different from the one that you need to send to the target so in such case you can use this uh, function this uh, line of code to change the no old column names to new column names in such cases we can have old names and new columns it can be anything okay if it can be the original columns might be with short form like serial number s and o something and you may want to change it to something else then you can use this option so sir so the same one that how we have done here right using the replace here we will give the column names so this is the new df that i am creating similar way i am taking the reduce function applying the lambda uh, lambda operation like in this df for this uh, each column with the column renamed because again we are working with columns we have to use with the column renamed and here old columns these are the old columns right so for this and these are the new columns and how many times it should check is the length of the columns as a range and then on which data frame we should apply means we shouldn't apply on this data frame because df2 is already modified as per the requirement so we need to use this cust space df which is still holding the spaces in the column names so that is what we have done here and in that i'm show uh, i'm uh, giving the show uh, okay just to see the output and when i run this you can see the old names of the cust space df have been replaced with the latest names that i have sent in the new columns and if you notice there is underscore in the email and the same has been updated here but whereas in the original data frame it is the dot in the cust space df customer dot email is there but here i am sending a mapping that with the customer underscore email column it is updated this way so friends these are the ways we can update the column names using the pi spark thank you for watching the video friends please subscribe to my channel for more interesting learnings thank you